Hey guys, it's Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on Twitter. This is your basic Sorgonomics, and uh, this time I wanted to talk a little bit about uh, Facebook video. Uh, have you have you noticed have you noticed the trends? And this is what's really got me intrigued. And I've started playing a little bit. I mean, at this point, I, I've posted my first video in this vein. I'm hoping to do more here in the future. Uh, so the Facebook videos that really kind of pop. What are you noticing? What are you stopping for? When you go down your Facebook feed, it's typically the ones where you don't have to hit play and listen, right? Uh, right? I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's not all of you. Maybe it's some of you. And that's really intrigued me. I'm seeing The Verge do this. I'm seeing other media outlets I've never heard of do this. Um, and, 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 and trying to figure out this part where a lot of them are square. And I, I think that's just a, it, it pops and takes up more real estate when you're, you're going down the feed. Uh, but the word thing, the, this visual, you know, look, I actually have a friend, he's a, a visual graphic 3d artist, uh, a video, video graphic artist, I guess I can call him, uh, in the long run, but he, he would do these videos several years ago and we did them for, for, for the job that we had, um, where I was an editor and it would be this, um, there's a name for it that escapes me at the moment, but it would just be kind of words on screen. Like maybe you see, you know, words kind of sliding on the screen and, 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 and the graphics moving and panning in and out um, to like song lyrics or somebody talking over it. Uh, and that's what this reminds me of. I told him the other day, I was like, hey, remember that thing that you did? Guess what's popular right now with Facebook video? And I think there's a really a good opportunity there. So... The best Facebook videos aren't necessarily these Facebook Live ones like I'm kind of doing off on the side here or just taking a video like this that we're putting on YouTube anyways and just tossing them on here um, or these hour and a half things that we do at the Wrestling Mayhem Show and throwing them on Facebook. Why not, right? Maybe, maybe a lot of people are checking them out. You're probably not getting a lot of engagement, which isn't going to help it going further. And did you get a message across, which should be the purpose of this entire thing? What I should be doing is taking portions of this video and having videos or uh, the graphics pop up and what I'm saying and the poignant points for me to make that'll just catch your eye as you're scrolling through uh, checking out cat videos and baby pictures on Facebook. That seems like the right strategy. So again, as I like to do, try to experiment, see where the puck is moving to overuse another term. Um, and it is hockey season here in Pittsburgh, but uh, it's 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 been intriguing. So so thankfully, in my background, um, video editing and doing a fair amount of graphics work with titling and everything over the years, um, I got to dig back into that a little bit uh, with these videos. So I'm combining it um, partially with that and partially with. And maybe I'll talk about this at length somewhere else. I'm trying to do some videos around my neighborhood, just a little bit like, hey, here's what's going on. Here's this construction. Here, here's this going on. Um, hoping, hoping to be some germs of what I hope to be a further project, community project uh, down the line. I just want to get some proof of concepts, see if anybody's listening um, and experiment with this idea. So far, uh, 24 hours later, it looks like. Uh, we've had a, maybe about 100 views on, on something like this, but I haven't really pushed it too hard, and it's a very neighborhood-centric thing, so I can't imagine that it's going to explode that much unless it becomes a city-wide thing that, that people check out. It's also not terribly uh, dynamic at this point. And if you want to see what I'm talking about, um, you can go to uh, uh, Facebook uh under Sorgatron Media and look for the beach view and videos um, about, you know, again, just a little bit of, always a little bit of facts and, and imagery around the construction that's happening around the Port Authority. Um, again, just kind of working on my storytelling a little bit in this in this new kind of fashion. So what should you be doing? First of all, if you're, you know, not a graphically proficient person, you know, that's kind of okay because there's some videos that are going around where they're taking the square format, they're putting a video in the center of it. And <laughs> 10 
attention. To catch somebody's attention. Probably also something short. The video that I made, I think is around maybe 20 or 30 seconds in the long run. Again, boom, 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 in and out. Shouldn't go too much longer. As it is, I, I edited, at, uh, as of this recording of video, San Martino. It went about mm, five-ish minutes, probably. I feel like it was far, far, far too long on Facebook. But I made sure to have a nice visual of Bruno San Martino at the podium, a big title there in the corner, and of course my logo marks in the corner for Wrestling Mayhem Show and and, and, and Sorgatron Media to have that very visual, you know, I, just because it's a very showpiece kind of thing, you know, just like hey look what we did over here, you know, aren't we so important, you know, which is what you want to do exactly, right? Um, so I help to capture people with boom, Bruno San Martino. Boom, thing with the seal of the city of Pittsburgh. Hey, there's Bill Peduto, Mayor Bill Peduto uh, hanging in the corner there. Um, wow, I might want to check this out. Not what they close up of Bruno talking about whatever, because maybe that's not enough. I'm like, oh, Bruno's talking about stuff. He's It's Pittsburgh. He talks about stuff. Bruno's around everywhere. Um, not everywhere, but, you know, if you're, in this, if you're in Pittsburgh, you haven't run into Bruno at one point or another. Hey, look, he's over there at that thing on the stage. Um, especially if you swing through Bloomfield. Uh, pretty common Karens. But anyways, it's like seeing a fountain. Yeah, you're going to see one. Um, or a river. <laughs> Bruno's awesome, by the way. Also Dan Marino, surprisingly. But uh, just a little bit of experimentation and even a little bit of, you know realigning a little bit of those longer videos so those first few frames are eye-catching. Like, more important than ever with the way Facebook has kind of changed around how what video means on social media. Um, me, as kind of a follow-up, uh, is kind of a bigger deal to me than YouTube. YouTube is a place where I put videos. Facebook is a place where I can activate a community. And have been putting money that I feel like it's actually doing something. Um, it's actually the first place where I've been putting money into advertising for some of my personal business properties. Um, and that's significant, that it's kind of gained that confidence with me finally. And I've been a real big stickler on a not pay for play. Um, check out past episodes of this. Um, I think it was something about how Facebook is screwing you. Yeah. Search that up. Probably some good SEO. But anyways, so my thoughts on that. Go keep watching uh, Sorgatron Media on Facebook, Wrestling Mayhem Show. I'm going to probably try to figure out a few things there. Ooh, I actually got some really interesting ideas for IndieWrestling.us. Uh, uh, may, may see some videos pop up here and there, uh, hopefully in this vein. Uh, so watch out for that. Keep your eyes peeled. Let me know what you think of the videos that do come up. Uh, maybe a message, private channel, something like that, if it's a critique of some sort. Um, and uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. And, and, and it's interesting. It's interesting to see how Facebook is changing the look and the intention of video online. It's a new area. It's a new era. <laughs> we'll see you guys next time. Sorgatron.com. Sign up for the newsletter. We'll see what we write about this week. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.